was yesterday about the chief being good or the Falcons being the Falcons. What I try to tell them every week. What do I try to tell them every week? The Falcons aren't to be trusted. The Falcons are not to be trusted. If you needed a solidification of the fact that Falcons aren't to be trusted, how many teams could find a way to take a lead on a touchdown <laughs> and now be trailing after the extra point? See how they're ahead right now? Yeah. yeah they are you see ahead. how they're not about to be ahead anymore? Yeah, you see how they lost the game? That happened very quickly. Right. And you're going to ask me what this is about? I mean, look, the Chiefs were scored on them with fake punts. Alex Smith had a huge yards per attempt number, which you never have, but it's really just going to a bunch of tight ends. And Julio Jones hurt his hamstring, which means this offense might be done for. It wouldn't matter who was on the other side. The Falcons would have found a way to lose that game the exact same way if they were playing against Vanderbilt. <laughs> but their offense shouldn't be the one losing it. Keep in mind, Bomani, their defense is really bad, but the way that you can't lose the game is with your offense allowing Kansas City to score points. Your defense allows enough points on its own with Without Matt Ryan helping him get a couple more. Oh, yeah. Did we mention that Matt Ryan threw a pick six to go along with that pick two that he threw right there? Did we get to the round? The only thing that game was missing was afterward one of their players getting busted for soliciting a <laughs> prostitute because that's the most Falcon thing to happen ever. Yeah. Or your franchise quarterback deciding, hey, I got a little free time. Who wants to fight some dogs? <laughs> this doesn't sound like bitterness at all. How about the time their first thousand yard rusher, they stopped the game to give him the ball and he he ended the game with 995 <laughs> yards. Would you like to talk about the time Jerry Rice scored five touchdowns on Charles Toes Demery in 1990 while Dion's on the other side doing I don't know what? How about the time the head coach left the letter in lockers because he was going to quit his job because the quarterback oh, got yeah, caught dog fighting? Bobby Petrino, yeah, that was good. How about the time they scored two points in a playoff game? Uno dos. Yeah, there's that. Or maybe when they blew a 17-point lead in the second half of the <laughs> NFC Championship game. I could have told you all those things were going to happen.